hello welcome back to series magic kitchen so today when i was returning back from uh, from school uh, in home i had a surprise so my brother and my mother started preparing pizza so let's see their recipe so take grated mozzarella cheese So we are adding some butter into the cheese. So now we are going to place this bowl on the pan containing water. So as we all know this is the double boiling method. Now add some milk. So after melting this, we are going to add this layer to the pizza, so which it gives a very good taste. So now we are going to beat it and keep it in freezer for a while. Make sure that you are not keeping in the deep freeze. Now into a bowl add some hot water and add 2 tablespoons of yeast also add half tablespoon of sugar and now pour some lukewarm water now stir it once now let us test it into a mixing bowl add 2 cups of two maida cups maida add salt mix it well mix it well Olive oil After half an hour it's been double the size See how fluffy it is So now let's divide the dough into four parts This is called makka atta. It will be available in all the supermarkets. It's nothing but maize flour or maize powder. So now roll the dough by dusting some makka atta.
Now take the dough and prick it with a fork. This helps to keep it from rising too much. Now we are preparing the crust of the pizza. The crust lays the base of the pizza. Now take pizza sauce and apply it all over the dough. Make sure that the sauce is applied evenly. Now take the mixture of cheese and butter which we have prepared previously and spread it all over. So these are called tortilla wraps. Now we are going to use this and place it on the base of the pizza. Here we have used multigrain tortilla wrap. Now again spread the pizza sauce. Now take some grated mozzarella cheese and add it on the top. Now we are going to add some toppings to our pizza. First we have added corn. And then petals of onions. Red bell peppers. And some yellow bell peppers. Here we got some olives. Consuming olives reduce the risk of cardiovascular disease by preventing the oxidation of cholesterol and the buildup of fat in the arteries. So now let's bake our pizza. See, our pizza is cooked to a crisp and the cheese is melted and the crust is having some crunch to it. You can sprinkle some oregano seasonings and chili flakes and serve it hot with a cold beverage. That's all, we are done. If you like this recipe, please like, share and don't forget to subscribe by clicking the bell icon. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.